Delta, 4-3 Tango. You should see open flames down by the creek there. So today we're looking out um, for our smoke because the fire's on this side of this creek here and we don't want it to get on that side. It has in a couple places, so we're also looking at those and making sure it doesn't progress or get over our line that we already made. And we're making sure it doesn't get into our green over here, which could, you know, potentially compromise our line and where it is now. So that's why you gotta stay here and be vigilant and uh, you know know what's going on, monitoring the radio, doing a lot of uh, thinking in your brain, setting trigger points. This is our third day out here. Uh, the first day we prepped uh, housing developments. So we started uh, right at the uh, entrance to the driveway and you're just doing an evaluation of our ability to uh, fight fire. And then we get inside there and we uh, prep the house. When I say prep, I'm talking about uh, looking for anything that could cause fire spread at that structure. So we want to make the, the, the structure sound. So we're getting rid of uh, duff around the house. Uh, some people have wood piles up against the house, so we'll move that out of the way. Cleaning the gutters, cleaning the roof. Uh, anything that could cause the structure to be involved in fire. Today, uh, this is sort of our line in the sand right here, this road. So we're going to make sure that uh, the fire can't cross this road and uh, head out towards uh, the city of Sisters. We're, we're looking at wind conditions, weather conditions to see if it changes, smoke conditions. Uh, we've taken several walks down through here to look to see if uh, the fire has changed since this morning. And so that's kind of what we're looking at. And we're listening to the radio to find out what the crews down the hill are doing as well. So this is the line of the sand right here. So we're just making sure it doesn't get beyond this point. 